Hi, here's Angel and I'll say, uh, talking the happy days, I know they may be some hard feel weird to you, but it won't wait. But as a matter of fact, I think cool Christmas, yes? And everybody loves Christmas. Christmas is really weird. We have to bring the Christmas tree into our apartments and houses. And the best Christmas tree is always the friends and in a forest and you have to put the tree with your own hands and uh, bring it to your house. And it is very romantic for us to have this Christmas tree smelling mostly beautifully in your house uh, for some period of days like maybe a week or maybe even five or four days and maybe very romantic, uh, romantic and it is a part of a big game for Christmas and this game is played worldwide just like football and it, it is to be played only once a year so it makes us even more treasured because Christmas uh, contains only three um, days yeah it is 24, 25 and 26 of uh, uh, December so this is a very very short period of time but at the same time this is the big celebration ever this is the big holidays uh, worldwide on the entire planet uh, there are things to be bought for Christmas and there are uh, the trees to be bought and uh, trees of every kind, plastic trees and some illuminated trees and trees without lights and with lights and fake trees and whatsoever and there are presents to be bought and to be shared and there are a uh, huge amount of uh, Christmas perfect dress codes so you have to wear red and green and white and there are uh, songs made for Christmas etc etc so it's a huge business and Christmas is celebrated quite by everyone because this is a big 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 party for everyone for every religion and I'm quite sure that a lot of people who are actual Muslims and maybe actual Buddhists and actual Jewish and whomsoever they are still uh, somehow uh, having warm feelings for Christmas just because this is a big celebration for, uh, for the entire world uh, a lot of times for yourself and for your family because uh, you don't have to go to work and uh, school is having days off so this is a big pleasure for everyone worldwide and it's celebrated for hundreds of years and yeah this is something nice I do understand and Christmas is something really cool and everybody loves Christmas right uh -huh. so um, I just think there is a possibility not to ruin this nature in this world by uh, falling all the Christmas trees and then uh, throwing them out on the street like it happens in the entire Europe uh, a day after Christmas is over and we're done with Christmas, we're done with Christmas trees and trust me, uh, on December 26th and 27th the Christmas trees usually are already somewhere on the street and um, somewhere not even on the street in a container but really on the street and nobody needs them and nobody cares for them and they're the real trees and it hurts me to the knees that uh, something like that is happening uh, hundreds of years ahead and, uh, in a row and uh, nobody actually cares for them so I think there is a time um, to make a different celebration called happy days and I think just fair enough we're having we're having four happy days a year each of them three days long and uh, the happy days are actually built on also the sharing present and sharing uh, your time with your family but uh, also on renovating and regreening the world. I think it's much uh, more beautiful than the Christmas trees lying around the street. And uh, if there's a possibility to commercialize this thing, uh, it's been created by me. I just uh, call it Happy Day. Um, it can be called Love Days, but I prefer Happy Days. So uh, these Happy Days are going to be celebrated worldwide, and we're having uh, four times uh, Happy Days, three days along each of them, uh, starting with my birthday, uh, July 7th to July the 10th, and um, 
September the 7th to September the 10th, and uh, March the 7th to March the 10th, and May the 7th to May the 10th, uh, we might be having zero CO2 or zero uh, problems with the nature or reading this world of climate change or whatsoever these things are cool like because uh, if everybody would plant a tree somewhere in a garden or somewhere in a park or plant a plant or a flower and it is uh, made possible by the politician it is it made possible by the um, well, there's a businesses worldwide because it's a test to bring a Christmas tree, huge one, to your apartment. It's not the easiest thing in the world, but to plant a tree, uh, it's probably much easier if there is a commercial um, possibility. So, is I mean, like uh, really small trees put into to be put into soil are really, really easily to be handled, and uh, if it is possible, and the bright minds of the uh, of the world are enabling uh, somehow really small trees to be um, well to be created extra for this uh, holidays and for this celebration this world is going to be a green green place and very beautiful and maybe there's going to be uh, zero hunger because if you're planting a really small um, baby of, a, of an apple tree and uh, there are <laughs> Free apples worldwide in every park in every country. Uh, there is probably zero hunger, and uh, trust me, it's going to be a very green world and um, having less problems with climate change and uh, nature, uh, which will be just flourishing and uh, renovating itself. So, what about these happy days? I know this is just my vision, but every vision can be materialized. And, uh, be made a product very very fastly if somebody is, uh, with big money is interested and uh, trust me Facebook was not so very popular some years ago because it was unknown and this vision was not in the world but as it is this is the uh, biggest game ever played and I think this happy days can be also the biggest game to be played and uh, the entire world would be involved. Uh, if we're just um, having these holidays free of school and free of where everybody would just love to play this game. So how about we're playing this game uh, including renovation of Earth and a renovation uh, of the nature and um, yeah, recreating the world because I think nowadays maybe God is not there anymore and I cannot help this world to be greener or more beautiful, but as it is, uh, humans are godlike and they are having tools to recreate their world, so how about we just not waiting for God to make this world more perfect, but just uh, doing something ourselves. Okay, that was my idea. I'd love to go on TED Talks and I'd love to get Nobel Prize that for. Thank you. I love it.